Our front window this week, you'll see we have a display of fur coats, and you can get, there's a silver fox fur coat over there that's selling for $129, that you can't beat that price. And the other window, you'll notice we have tons of children's and infant goods, which really help people today. They're, you know, trying to make ends meet with their kids. They can come in here, they can get a lot of clothes, all the other paraphernalia, height chairs, things like that. The things we don't carry are cribs and car seats due to the legalities with those items. We have a large houseware department. You can find everything from the odd knickknack to beautiful sets of china dishes. We have a crafting area. And we have clothes for everyone, for men, women, teens. We have a section of uh, fancier dress clothes for that special night out. We plan on doing a thing for prom, before prom, of, you know, better dresses that girls will be looking for for prom. Um, purses, every kind of purse you can imagine. We've sold coach bags in here. Um, people have had some real deals. They got a coach bag for $12. You can't beat it. Leather jackets. Um, we have pretty much everything you can think of in here. I'm the only staff person here. All the other people that work in the store are volunteers, so we have very low overhead. All our items are donated. So everything that we make goes back to the shelter to keep support our programming there. We walked in here one day, and I wasn't part of that group, but they walked in here, they saw this. Consolidated management were extremely helpful and, you know, willing to work with us and stuff, but a lot of it just had to do with this, the look of the store. And I think part of it had to do for the women that everything was purple. And purple is the color for domestic violence. And it just got to be between the relationship we were building was consolidated and the way the store looked, it just seemed like it. everybody got this feeling it was just meant to be. You know, it just was solely something from the heart that we felt it was just this was what was supposed to happen for us and that's how we ended up here. It feels great to help the agency grow. I, you know, I, it's something that they needed to do, we needed to find a way and it feels really great to be a part of it. The benefit and the mission of Women Safe is, uh, is so important for us to be able to recognize someone else's need. Uh, but it also helps the current businesses that are here just as well. So I came up and talked to the person who's in charge, Patty, and filled out the paperwork, and uh, it's been a fit. But apparently these jeans go for like $150, hundred, anywhere between $100 and $100, and they're $14.99 here. You know, um, we have uh, J. Crew jacket, six dollars and fifty cents. Um, we have one of these BC BCBG, popular name with the girls, pair of shoes, seven ninety nine. We have a Fendi bag for eleven ninety nine. Most of our purses, though, actually run in the dollar fifty to three dollar category. Most of these are, you know, no more than a dollar fifty to three bucks. And women love purses, so they donate a lot of them because they have them, and then they buy different ones. <laughs> it all works. They can have one for every outfit. Actually, I've been stopping in and purchasing since the store opened. Um, as a township trustee. Uh, Women Safe came to the Board of Trustees at our last meeting and the township has uh, waived all of their signage and zoning fees to help them uh, minimize their cost to the town, you know, to the to their program. It's a fantastic little store. Um, and I received a phone call today that they were in need of uh, a volunteers. So I'm here to help out in any way I can.
people out here in Chesterland don't get an opportunity uh, for the organizations like they do when they're out in Chardon. So this is a great way to bring the western tier of Geauga County um, some of the services that are offered and um, some of the revenues to go back to, to an excellent organization. I'm thrilled to have them here in this community. It only adds to um, our, our open spots as far as retail goes. And um, I think it's a, it's a great thing that they're doing.